A few days ago, I uploaded the Does This Even Have a Counter video. Many of you may have seen it, but if you haven't, basically there's this new build order that people are doing with the Portuguese after a couple changes, and it's constant all-in aggression. I've been wondering if people can deal with it, and in this game, we had another example of someone trying this, only it was in a tournament versus a top five player. Believe me when I say that you will see situations in this game that you maybe have never seen before. Enjoy. It'll be an interesting discussion here as we enter game two. Can Draken get another win? Again, just to restate what I had said before, he did end up getting a win <clears throat> against Yo on a closed map. That's kind of what he's known for. This is his bread and butter. With Portuguese and the new changes recently, Dave, I would expect some craziness. And by the way, what are we doing with colors now? Same thing. Uh, Leary is red and Draken is blue. Okay. You were right. He changed Dude, his color. Leary yeah, Leary goes, he starts at three, and then he goes four, five, six. He never goes seven or eight, though, I don't think. <laughs> yeah. It's he goes back to three. Just Leary things. Mm -hmm. But, okay, so when I think this new Portuguese build with all-in organ guns, I think timing's the most important thing, and the build I mm -hmm. saw from Samero, which I know Draken will know, and I know Ganji yeah, knew. Yeah, that one, too. But, it's sick. But Ganji forgot his boar, which kind of ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> um, but, yeah, like, I think you could almost always get the castle up on someone's face if they're going for a traditional scout build especially with with the poles i'd say because i think poles have to go 26 pop up i, I don't know like I, that's where my mind's going organ guns but i guess we could also be talking about portuguese and their cheaper monks too mm -hmm. but i do not think standard meta from draken i don't think multiple tcs i just think all in aggression when i see this pick yep yep and he's gone for the mill first so you don't go for the lumber camp now because you generate wood from foraging those berries. Mm -hmm. And that is complete. It feels like it's completely changed the Portuguese Civ. Like completely. Just with that tiny little bonus. Well, Gives them the edge in early game and then allows them to get into the, uh, the gold units. I think more specifically, they were always really tough to stop if they got to all the working guns. And it just made that play so much better because you can go up 60 seconds faster to, to drop that castle. Mm -hmm. That's the scary thing about it. I do but like it's the change also a lot in Arabia. Yeah, it's made them decent on open maps. That's the thing, right? Like, there's suddenly... If you bring put them in your draft, it's not just, oh, this is a closed map save. Yeah. It could be an open map save. Too. Yeah, it, it could be, right? It's like a, that thought process in the back of your head. I think certain players uh, can take advantage of it better than others, right? Like, uh, players who are playing with a lot of gold armies all the time, like Archer Knight combined players yep. who like to do that, as opposed to like the more defensive style players. But yeah, it'd be Draken's done precisely what I have seen to be the consistent thing here. A uh, one villager on the straggler tree, and then the four villagers on the berries. And he's gonna try and go up to Castle Age much faster than Leary's faced up against before. Let's hope he doesn't uh forget his boar. Or shoot the Even boar with the forgetting his even forgetting his board, Ganji still almost had enough food. Yep. To click up to Castle Age. Like, <laughs> it's just a sick build, which tells me you may even be able to carve off one more villager if you're super optimal off that build. It's crazy. I, I just wonder if Draken is going to be bold enough to place this thing forward because he's just scouted the walls. That's not that long of a walk. And if you get a castle up on that corner there, you can take the stone mm -hmm. and the gold away from Leary. I think he should do it. And I think the most important thing when that time comes is you just send enough ills. Mm -hmm. So like, don't send five, send 10, and then you're going to be using the market like crazy anyways. So just put those 10 villagers on a mining camp on that gold. It seems like the dream scenario. And I, I don't even know, like, do poles get redemption? Like, maybe they do. Um, But similar... I think they have a decent monastery. Yeah. But I, I think the key, even before you talk about like converting the organ guns or killing the organ guns, it's where are the organ guns being created from. So if Leary expects this as a possibility, he might even want to make like two or three scouts a bit earlier, like skip some eco upgrades or try and get his castle age time faster than he would normally do in a boomed style game. He didn't forget the boar. He didn't forget the boar. That's good. By the way, I saw your uh, I saw your CBA video. Yeah. It's so funny, dude, because you uploaded that game. I was bored. I actually cast the 
in fast forward you playing that CBA game, which is the very first game of CBA I've ever cast. With oh, you being really? <laughs> and it's just crazy that you made a YouTube video on that. That exact it's game wild. or other games? Yeah, that exact game. Because th I sent you the message, remember? Like the guy said quitting is for, or like quitters I was win wondering like why that. you said that. And I sent that to you, yeah. Oh, okay. Because because I got that message twice within like the same hour or whatever. And I was like, well, this yeah. must be a thing. All right. Well, yeah, I mean, I, um, I had played like eight games prior to that. Because I had yeah. a cold and I was, had nothing else to do. And as I said to you, I'm a little concerned on the whole sib balance of cba these days because there's so many different uh unique units bad. i've played i've played a bunch like i usually play every friday it's it's not that it that bad yeah the, the tricky thing is of course it's like and this is the thing that's hard to understand and i would said this to you it's like i don't know if i'm that good these days i know i felt like i used to be good but i think that it also yeah, yeah. just depends on coordination right which is a big thing in that it's hard to tell and there's some i the thing i like about it now is that I used to know all the different, like, how unique units match up against each other. Now it's a bit more confusing for me because of so many civs. Yeah. And yeah, I haven't yeah. played a, like, you know, Magyar Hussar against uh, Obuk or yeah, something like that. Like there's some, some weird sort ones. of weird, weird civ uh, matchup. So I get a feel for that with new CBA, which is kind of fun. Uh, the players are, teammates are not so good. It's we see Market Blacksmith here from Drac, and he's just going for it's the castle so drop good. approach. And this is a Leary perfect is going. Build scouts yep. this is perfect he went normally you'd go two vills if you're staying at home he went one vill and then loom because he's going to leave his base here this is amazing mm -hmm. i mean you would you would hope that he leaves his base i think that gives him his best chance and as i've been saying about this ever since i saw samero do it in silver league i don't know how you stop this if it's done properly no i don't if you have a slow sieve i, I don't i don't know how but like i feel like i don't know i feel like you could maybe God, it's so tough. You would have to it's commit like even to feudal. You, You'd have to go like yeah, feudal age scouts and stay in feudal. But, and if you do that, then they just make the castle at home and then you're stuck in feudal. Exactly. And then you have organ guns, right? Yeah. Like maybe humans can do something about it. Yeah, if they, you they go, could. If you go 2TC and some scouts to keep this, the castle from being forward, mm -hmm. and then you let him mass up organ guns, but your eco is way far in front, I don't know. I mean, it all comes down to if Leary has... Two to three scouts in the middle right now and normally you're going to go for the eco upgrades first now leary went up one population faster than what you typically see and also what you typically see is you see the wood upgrade next you seed farms and then you get your wood upgrade you do not make a scout and we're not yeah we are seeing the wood upgrade now from leary and he's not going to be able to make the scouts for a while and here come the villagers right now dude i love oh, draken's commitment to this i love the build and the thing that you had mentioned to me after we both had seen that initial Samero uh, game that I didn't mm -hmm. pick up on at the time was he doesn't even buy the stone. No, right? No, like, he like has. You don't the, even it's, have it's, to it's buy the stone. Ridiculous, dude. It's such an optimized build. Yep. It's sick. I love it. And he's going all the way over here. He's, high, what, he, he's coming all the way over to cut off the secondary goal yep. from Leary. Instead of putting one at the front there, he's going to cut off the secondary goal. Leary's also taking wood over on this side. And that is a very difficult position for Leary. Leary sees the castle, but there's simply nothing he can do about it. Yep. He's got two scouts, but the Loom is in yep. for Draken. And Draken is even walling off his bills. So, what Bug. you could try is you could try like immediately drop a tower there. But if they send enough villagers, the tower is not going to do enough in most cases. Yeah. And you would have to see it and react to that immediately. So Leary's going to have a really think, fun time here. Do you think it actually might be worth like to? trap someone into trying to go for a forward castle if we're talking about ways to counter the strategy like you make it look like you don't have any military but secretly you're on stone or you're building military or something wait for the foundation to come down and then yola with like 10 vills two towers and military well if you go scouts it. they can wall in their vills so that could yeah. not work and and i guess the main thing is that's a big risk. Like, what if they just stay at home with the castle? And then you make yeah, all this stuff. Yeah, what if they come forward and with a castle, though, and you just die anyway? Yeah. <laughs> it's <laughs> just Leary so goes bad. For a castle of his own. Yeah. I honestly think Leary's current thinking is is spot on. But he need, first off, he needs to build this castle with way more fills. Leary. Yeah, not enough urgency here. Yeah. <laughs> no urgency. <laughs> okay, now he's like, all right, maybe, uh, maybe we need to... 
toss a few more bills on that. Um, but maybe what you do is you just try and wall all the pressure out behind your castle and farm like crazy and go fast imp. Yep. But I don't think that even Polish farming can compete with the market abuse that you see the clowns go for. But hey, I, I could be wrong. Hassar, winged Hussar do get a bonus against gunpowder units. Yeah. And actually, well maybe played from Leary organs. here. Yeah. This is, I, I will say this about the build. Obviously, like, it's very uh, clickbait to be like, can you even stop this? Blah, blah, blah. But it's very creative, right? And it's fun to talk about. It's fun to think about as we see the scout from Draken it's get the villager get kill. Oh, they just died barely. Um, but yeah, like, it's a strategic thing, which is exciting. Um, you know, I could use this opportunity to say it's better than clicking a button, uh, but uh, we're not going to make those jokes as Leary's on two TCs here. Not bad. Draken adding some food eco behind this. Still producing organ guns. Well, actually, he stopped producing organ guns. He's going to go for monks now to claim the relics in the center. And that's another benefit of this strategy, right? When mm -hmm. you have a forward castle, you just get those relics. Oh, Leary, God. though, has kept his scouts alive, which is great. Leary just lost four, uh, three villagers on the wood line on the left to the castle fire. Oh, no. I always oh, sent them back there after they built the castle. Oh, no. Yeah, that's that's really sloppy. Not something you yeah. want to see. But he is doubling down with more stone. Um, and Draken's shifted his way around here. It might seem silly, but I'd actually like to see Draken just take out Leary's market once he sees the walls. Because yep. that market's really helpful in these types of games to balance things out. He's going after the walls here. Which, <laughs> honestly... I take back the market thing. Walls melt the organ guns. Oh my goodness. That's five organ guns, and they've already taken 500 HP off of that wall. Organ gun also protecting the monks here, Dave. So that's that's good from Leary. He's not really able to get the relics right now, but he's trying to stop his opponent from getting them. Really curious what that wood's going to turn into here for Draken as he tries to save his monk and unfortunately does not. He did one more organ gun there. Sorry. Yep. Yeah, it sounded like you were maybe muted or busy, but it's it's all no, good. No, 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 no. <laughs> I was I, I was stuck in a loop. Sorry. All good. All good. I was I was completely transfixed by the uh, organ gun sh firing animation. It was pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, Draken, he's gonna want some benefit from trying to break in here with his organs if he's losing monks to the scouts from Leary, but mm -hmm. he does have two relics, and his monks are really cheap. And yeah, this is where we see the market. Uh, we're going to see all that wood get sold. Look at the eco at home for Draken. There's going to be gold mining there. Oh, he could have just, just taken that relic inside his base. <laughs> Instead, he's trying to make the way back. Maybe he goes right through the scouts. <laughs> there he sees it. Here we go. So what's faster? Full work farming where you get that big food boost when you farm around it? Or just using the market? It's looking pretty good for Draken, but he only has nine on food, so... Yeah, he's gonna be stuck with where he's at for a while, and and again, great job from Leary. I think he's killed two monks, but he's still not taking the relics himself, which I see as a big concern. And someone says, "Don't mangonels counter organ guns?" Not it. No, not really. No, they they get no. one shotted by multiple organ guns, and even though I think the tech tree says that organ guns should be good there, the um, monks being possible from the Portuguese will always just lead to them converting your siege. Leary's getting heavy plow. Okay, so that's good, but it also kind of delays your uh, your Imperial Age time, and Imperial Age is mm -hmm. already on the way from Draken. Difficult decisions here for Leary, right? He's buying himself time with these defensive castles as he loses a villager, mm -hmm. and he's getting his eco upgrades, so he should be able to build his food pretty well, but still Draken is going to have a significant advantage. What's your army? Right? Like, what? what is your army if you're Leary? Even if you make it to Imp, I don't know what that would be. Oh, he's... Wait, he's considering Cav here. He's going for the privilege oh. upgrade here. And he's dropping stables. He must know that Draken's up. Mm -hmm. The one thing I'd like to see a little bit more from of, from Draken, even though he only has 35 bills, maybe some more on stone. And now he's just throwing them on stone. Okay. Mm, so he's yeah. thinking about a secondary castle. Get the Trebs out. Get another castle blocking this area. Also, I'd love to see like just an outpost or something on the right side of Leary's base. Yeah, I agree. So he doesn't sneak out there and start booming in the middle, maybe. No, it's it's so tricky. Um, that's something that a lot of these these clown players don't do. Be but you know the reason is because 
it doesn't matter if Leary escapes at this point. Like, if, if they continue to push and accomplish what they're hoping to, uh, they should be more than fine even if something escapes there. As Leary comes in with his scouts... And Draken will save the one monk and lose the other one. Not within range with the castle, where yep. the castle was busy firing at the walls. So he does manage to save the other castle. He does have three relics, though, now. Does Draken go for Fatorius? It feels like no, right? I, I was going to say yes, but then I realized he didn't prep the houses. Yeah. So I think he either forgot the houses or will just find that out. Yeah, yeah he's going to place it, and now he's housed. So he's going to need the houses. But at least he has the treb on the way first. Because I think that's the most important aspect of this. He only has two monks right now, Dave. He doesn't have that many. If he had like five yep. or six, it'd be tough for Leary to engage right now. But Leary is still massing those knights. And he's also hidden that fact. But I think Draken's going to know the second this treb pops. Because it'll have the vision on the stables. And the outpost would help. Because the knights are probably going to sneak around to the right side and come in for a flank. Yeah. Can you imagine a siege workshop for Leary on the right, and then he rams in and runs in with knights? Draken would have Into nothing Into Draken's there. economy? Yep. Yeah. But it'd be epic because at the same time, Leary would have nothing to stop whatever Draken was pushing with. <laughs> I mean, Leary is still not on the way to Imperial Age, and he's just going knights. He's all in castling here. But if he doesn't get a good initial engagement, if he doesn't take out the treads, he's going to run out of stone to repair his castles. Yeah. And he's, oh man, Tristan, he's doing it. Petards. It's Petards. It's Petards from Leary. So he's probably going to try and get into Draken's economy at home with I, the knights. I, I'm wondering if he's going to be sneaky with the Petards on the sides or if there's a world. Nah, there's no way he could use the Petards for the castle, right? He needs to delete the walls and go out this yeah, side. Yeah, go to the right. Draken, you should have vision over there, my dude. Leary is Should still, have something over there. like, he's running out of space here, Dave, and he needs to fight yeah. soon, and Draken's going to have pikemen soon, plus he has the organs, plus he has the castle fire, and then he has monks with 12 range, and he's going to have six of them, and there's 15 knights. It feels like now might be an opportunity for Leary to take it, but he's trying to be as patient as possible because he knows his economy is stronger, and there he is deleting the walls, Dave. Yep. The he's petards. heading out with a monk to give him extra vision there, too. I like it. Uh, and he's going to loop the petards around. He's going to wait with his knights because he might need them in defense. Let's he's going to wait till his Let's petards go. are like halfway across. Man, I, I said this at the beginning. This might be the way to counter it, though, is just, just get some type of counter in. Maybe. Le Leary's forever like Draken, castle age. Draken should have vision here. He should have vision here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He should. There's no reason to not. It's such a small investment. And Draken's still so focused on his push. Now, oh here's, here's the deal. That Fittorio will melt to the knights, by the way. His entire eco will die if to he, the knights. If this happens to you, if you're Draken, you quick wall your vills and you never go home. It sounds stupid, but you going home means that you're allowing... You lose. Yeah, you lose. Yeah. You have to just dive even deeper into Leary's base, which is why this game's going to be epic. Leary trying to deal oh with this strategy that's been God. plaguing everyone. Draken is Draken's running with the Vils. He sees it. <laughs> He's running forward with the Vils. He says, get to safety. It's not safe here. Let's go. He realizes that's not going to happen. Wall him he in, Draken. Him back towards his wood line. And wall him in. all over his stuff. Oh, uh, he's not even trying to wall. You got to wall your Vils. Put stone or something. Oh. He's just trying to escape, and oh. Leary's in with the knights. Well, Leary can kill all of these Vils. Forward kill the Fatoria. Let's it's a go. forward Fatoria. Let's go! I've never seen this. Safest never seen area this. of his eco. <laughs> he didn't even garrison his bills. <laughs> no attempt to save anybody, really. I guess it was and an attempt to save them, but it didn't wasn't realistic. Let's put it that way. Leary is now leaving his base. Draken still doesn't have vision on this area. Leary is leaving his base, making a TC in the middle. Leary is still alive right now, but Draken could win this game <laughs> after losing his entire home economy and the first Victoria he's made. Draken is at 16 villagers right now. Five of them are in the TC. 11 of them are in Leary's base. Draken needs to convert every single knight to have a chance of. There's a lot of knights. There's only seven monks. These are pikemen, not um, halberdier. So you can't lose the monks, and you need everyone to get a conversion. But Leary is under so I mean, much every, pressure. Every conversion on a vill that Draken gets is a big boost to his eco. Yep. Not big fight. Lie. Big fight. You got to take those Huge knights fight. out. Can Leary make more knights? He's got his other knights coming back home right now, Dave. They're going to arrive, and it's going to help him win this fight. 
And I think if Leary takes the fight, he's he's in a good position in this game. I don't know if it means it's oh, over God. or what, but he just needs to take out those Trebs to slow this down for the time being. Yep, Trebs are going to be taken out. Draken, he's buying food. He has very limited resources. Only that Fitoria bringing him food right now. Zero on food, zero on gold, zero on stone, six on wood. It's such a crawl. Oh, man. Meanwhile, Draken's main economy is not looking too great. He's got two castles. He's dropping his... <laughs> well, yeah, his main economy, I guess, is the Fatorias. so... Yeah, that's his main fine. economy is in Leary's base, too. <laughs> but Leary is expanding still. Like, ah, oh, this could have... Uh, so frustrating. Well, okay, so so hear me out, though. I, I First off, I'm not saying I disagree. But I'm wondering, if you see the knights coming to your base, what do you even do? I actually think it's just the perfect counter or perfect play from Leary because you've you run got more Gordon villagers and forward. monks. Just like he did when uh, when he saw this stuff coming in. Ah, uh, that's true. You get to leave first off, you First off, you see the petards. You, it's, it's not like you see the knights. You see the petards. And then you can leave like ahead of time. And that's solid two minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's true. Or you just kill the petards, and then the knights can't get in. That feels like monks need to be coming out, and, and you're also going to want trebs. Leary's got to be like, why did I ban this freaking map? But thank God he didn't, because this is hilarious. I've never seen a full repository <laughs> other than like a meme, like, <laughs> you know, you're just flexing on someone. I know. He's got 70 pop technically, but realistically, he's only got 30 population. Dragon. Yeah. Leary donating a few knights there, desperate to take out the Fatoria. It would actually be a huge loss for uh, Draken if he loses this, and and Leary knows that. Oh my god! Just commit to it. Just commit onto it. With he the should knights. have built He's it like... between the castles, apparently. Yeah, yeah. There it goes. Wow. Second Fatoria destroyed this game. Draken going all in on gold, and Draken can afford. <laughs> he can afford to help. So... <laughs> <laughs> How did he get that upgrade? Dude, Leary's winning this, though. I mean, he's got three TCs in the middle well, now. Well, it, it might be a ring around the rosy for a while, though, because if there were two Trebs right now, with Halbs and those monks going for Leary's main eco... There are no Trebs. I, I know, but there's one on the way. Like, Leary's main eco is going to need to be abandoned, is kind of my point. So they might trade bases here. Also, the knights okay. that Draken converted, he should be using to... Take, chase down villagers that are running here. <laughs> Honestly, looking at Draken's base, I don't think Leary wants that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I think he might end up doing it, and I'm wondering if he's going to create more vills or if he's going to try and save resources for Imp. Uh, he's getting fletching now. Oh man, I mean, Draken still has a chance. Don't ask me how, but he still has a chance. He's got 21 halves. If he protects the Trebs and keeps moving around the map. He absolutely has a chance. He has a chance if Leary decides to go imp on one of these TCs at the back. Or the TC at the back. But he's nowhere near imp. Still just booming up. Got seven villagers villagers in the queue. And he should lose like 21 vills at the back of his base here. Yeah. The problem is that Draken is losing everything at his base. He'll never get back there. He's found the extra TCs. <laughs> and he no, still Leary's has running. really... No resources for another Fatoria. It needs another Fatoria. I should buy the wood or whatever. Okay, Draken can see those Vils running now. Mm -hmm. And if he were to just chase them, that might end up being the better move. It would be funny. Maybe he's leaving that TC there, so Leary accidentally goes imp in that one. But Leary's going to go crossbow and castlage. That seems to be the play. This is insane. Look at that army count. 30 versus 17. Draken absolutely yep. has a chance. Especially because the majority the of... Count. Of Leary's villagers are, are like, they're leaving. So they're not working right now. They, he doesn't have a farming eco anymore. Bro, Draken has 10 vills. Legitimate strategy from Leary. Dive in with the knights. Kill all the vills before Draken gets another TC. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know if you need a TC. Draken knows. He's just like, army trebs. Army trebs. Let's go. And the other thing, too, is it's, it's actually easier to play from Draken's position because you don't have an eco to pay attention to. Leary yeah. has to do so much more from this position. I mean, it's a second Fatoria now for Draken, so he's going to start racking up resources a little bit faster. Oh, my goodness. Also has the five relics, which has always paid off. Plus, he's got Leary's gold. That's the thing for Leary, too. He's like, I guess the only place he could take gold is in Draken's base. But look, Leary's oh losing Vils. He's going to lose this oh TC. Oh, my God. This is insane. Oh, my God. Draken, don't tell me you can win this. 
this strategy's so crazy, man. Just the timing. Also, when he researched Talb when he had six of them, I was judging him. I've I've liked it a little bit more ever since. But he he's needs gonna to get see the really good conversions now. on the crossbows. Like yep. really good conversions. He's gonna see them. Leary's doing the right thing in that he's building up his army oh. before he takes an engagement. The Halbs got and pulled now back here for come some the reason. Knights. Halbs are at the house at the back. Draken, you need to get the Halbs to the monks. Leary's not committing onto those monks. He's got a lot of crossbows though. I have the biggest it... smile on my face right now, and I hope everyone else watching this with us does as well. This is so crazy. Leary's just dropping range on range on range. Normally, you want Bombard Cannons if you actually have economy. I think in this case, Draken's just... Actually, what he should probably do is make a few more, more organ guns, but he's just going monks to convert those crossbows. That's a big army from Leary. That's a huge army. This is a massive army. The converted knights will help against the crossbows, but there's just so many crossbows here. Yeah, yeah. And they're going to clear up all of the halves. The knights are getting some decent value there. We got some monks going for crossbow conversions now. Leary is losing quite a few units here, but Draken is getting his helps taken out. Draken has a lot of resources in the bank, though. Yeah, and he, he has... He queue more monks, especially. 14 monks in the queue, Tristan. <laughs> and, I mean, if he can just save what's left of the helps, I think he might end up being okay. Leary might run out of gold here. And Draken just here. not hesitating here. He's like, let's go. I'm going to convert all your crossbows. I need crossbows. What monks are world? cheap. Monks are cheap to Draken right now. What? The crossbows are dying. Are you kidding Still only me? one Treb. Still only one Treb supporting this, but the crossbows are all <laughs> dead here. I'd love to see Draken get a Treb <laughs> on the eco in Leary's base. Even just killing houses right now, I think is very valuable. The way of the clown, people. The way of the clown. Draken, 68 pop. 40 of that's Fatoria's. He's pushing Leary somehow. Leary's down to 10 army at the moment. Yep. 10 army. Monastery is dead now. Knights are coming in. What? And those crossbows are going to die. Oh, boy. Leary doesn't want to... You don't want to call the GG in a game like this, dude. No. You, you know he's down to, like, single digit, barely double digit villagers. Okay, a great switch here from Leary. Also, I, Draken just uncued a couple monks. But Leary's mm -hmm. going to go light calf. Now, he doesn't really have the food eco. But I feel like donating Lycav or using the Lycav with the crossbows could do it, which should prompt Draken to make more halves. But also, I think like four or five organ guns mixed in, <clears throat> excuse me, as yep. he makes Vatoria number three, would also be hugely helpful in these fights. He should still start, I'm convinced, he should just get one tread to start working away on the eco from Leary at the back. At like, like home. Leary's, Leary's housed right now. You don't see really any buildings forward, and Leary, one thing he's short on is space. Yeah, yeah, If yeah. you start clearing up all the houses, stables, this TC back here, everything like that, it'd be really, really good. You know, the struggle Plus, is, like, I honestly think if Draken were to just pull back for a moment, he could actually be okay. But when you're behind yeah. so many villagers, you never want to do that. He hasn't had a TC in a very long time, so that's why he's always pushing forward. That helped, by the way. The in the back, by the way. Light calf? in the stables at the back of Leary's base as well. Because he doesn't oh. have any stables <laughs> in the middle. He's I forgot only the archer ranges in the middle. So his yeah. light cav are going to be there. Leary has a lot of crossbows. 31 now. Yeah, that's that. I think it's maybe at the point of too many. Uh, as Draken oh, don't give is converting Don't give bills. bills to Draken. No, that's a huge boost to his <laughs> eco, bro. Don't do it. That's a massive I can't wait till Draken there. just drops a mining camp on that gold too. <laughs> He might make a stable there. That's a there. huge swing. I think he's, he needs a lumber camp, honestly. I, I think he's could wasted some of his conversions on villagers, uh -oh. and now the crossbows are here. Oh, shoot. And he doesn't have any knights to deal with those. Uh, run away! There's no organ guns either. Oh, and the light cap came you... in from the other side, Dave! Bro, you live by the clown, you die by the clown. Currently dying by the clown. Wow. Is Draken. Light cap. Looking for monk snipes. Not enough conversions left over. He's taking out a few crossbows. He's shooting with the crossbows, but the halves are going down. And Leary is microing his way through this entire army from Draken, but Draken has now gotten Cavalier. There's a chance. And he's got three <laughs> Fatorias still. <laughs> There's. I know a lot of people are going to say GG right now, but there is a chance, okay? You still have like 10 more monks that are on the way if you're Draken. You've got uh, three Fatorias, and your opponent is stuck on Castle Age Army. If you mm -hmm. can get Cavalier with Imp Armor, 
you get some insane fights upcoming. And he's getting Imp Armor. He's researching Cavalier. He actually could still win this game. No TC. No TC. No life TC. For Who needs it? <laughs> for, Who for needs a long TC? Time. <laughs> Oh my goodness gracious. I just don't think I don't think the food's coming in fast enough. And I think like oh there's another Fitora. Oh my god. Four of them. Might as well make it five at this point. Oh. I mean, thank thank you to Draken for giving us this game. I just want to add that. Like people uh kind of clowned on him and uh didn't predict that he could even make it to platinum after gold league. He played so good on all the maps, including arena, obviously. But like this is the build we talked about, but that we just didn't expect him to have a chance after he lost his entire base. Yep. And he has put up such an incredible fight. Very the, impressive stuff. The problem for Leary here is that he's still in Castle Age. He doesn't have anything to take out like this fortification yeah. over here. He so also Draken doesn't just know. Plays super condensed. Yeah. Yeah. Like he, he saw one stable foundation. He doesn't know it's a full commit. If there's 30 Cavalier on the map, Leary's dead. Leary has no way of defending. Yeah. And I think it might. Like, Leary might be dropping a castle at some point, trying to go in, but he might not have an army when he makes it there. Oh, Draken just showed him on the wall. Oh, Draken just showed him for a second. Ooh. What does Leary do? Did he notice that? He's going for four works in Draken's base. <laughs> Draken's going to head to his own base. <laughs> and a castle. Okay, here these, come the Cavalier. These Cavalier have all of the armor upgrades. Remember that. They're so good. I think he and, needs oh, a couple Castle more. Castle crossbow just not doing enough damage to these. Oh, boy. Yeah, I mean, the monks like, are going to go down for, for Draken. Monks. Yep. But the ca does the castle go up and do the crossbows survive? That's the question. They're just going to have to hide these in the TC, I think. I don't think that castle goes up. No. That gets denied. And there's more Cavalier the on the might... way. Dragon's going to... Oh. <laughs> Leary's up to him. Leary is up to Imp, Dave. But what army is he going to have? And Leary taps <laughs> out! Leary taps out. He says, I can't deal with this crap. Why did I ban Arena? I should have banned uh, I should have banned it like everyone told me to. Oh my goodness. Uh, realistically, if you look at the actual population, the actual working population, we have a 31 population victory at 53 minutes from Draken. Unbelievable game. That was 13 insane. 13 bills in a dream. 13 bills in a dream. Okay, so his population <laughs> says 111. Actually, he's at 31. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. So, I mean, like, there was a pretty uh, glaring error, as you said, Dave. Uh, he didn't know the sneak was coming. We have to, of course, applaud yeah. Leary for petarding in the first place because that was a really good play. I yeah. ask again, how on earth do you stop this crap? Because if you don't stop the castle, if you can't win the game after taking out their whole base Zico... How do you win the game? This is Leary of all of all people, but what an entertaining one. Do you think that's an early GG from Leary, or do you actually think that he is straight up dead there? Uh I think he's dead. Honestly, do. Because yeah. all the light cav went down, right? He's got his food eco is trying to set up in Draken space, which maybe he can get set up, but he can never protect. He mm -hmm. can't get the castle up, which means he can't, even if he gets up the imp, he has no trebs. Yep to siege down all that stuff and there's no way he's keeping his crossbows alive against the full armor cavalier in the two minutes he needs to get yeah, up to him i agree he doesn't he won't have an army him being no. an imp with 60 more villagers will mean nothing by the time he makes it there that, that's, that's insane, an insane dude. game i can't wait to look holy i want to look use capture age look at the uh economy population <laughs> Okay, economy, population, military population. Those are some very different graphs right there. Mm -hmm. Leary always had the villagers. He just couldn't get the numbers there. I mean, he dropped the castle originally because he felt as though he needed to stop the organs. Then he went all in knights against the fast stamp. Did more damage than I think he was even hoping for in his opponent's base. But it was just, I guess it cost so much for Leary to get there. I mean, I'm looking at the resources collected now and I'm kind of stumped. I like I like Draken's eco EAPM, average fourteen. Yeah, <laughs> he didn't need it. <laughs> now does that does that count as APM when he builds a Fatoria? Because <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> There's four instances there where that would have contributed. Yeah. Oh man, I mean that's just not the map that Leary would want, uh, and he he Dra gave Draken the opportunity and paid the price there in that game. Draken's in my chat. 
he said easy game smile <laughs> yep yep mr platinum that's the swagger we it's like it mr plat right <laughs> mr plat oh let's go dude well draken that game. will probably be the only time you get to play arena in the rest of your group in titans league uh no one else is going to make that mistake so practice fortified clearing and, and regicide fortress <laughs> yeah. but uh a great game and you know we had said that the goal for draken going in against yo uh, going in against Leary and MBL is probably just get one win there, right? So he's accomplished that. Maybe he has Leary on tilt. Maybe he can get win number three or something. But um, Leary's got to be frustrated with himself and has to re regain his composure now. Thanks again, everybody, for watching this cast. Um, if you didn't hear in the video, this was actually part of a full series. And what I typically do is I have the best individual games go to the YouTube channel. That way you know... If this video goes up, it's going to be a banger. And then the full series I will have on my second YouTube channel, which is called T90 Extras. We make it really simple for you, though. Anytime I do this in the description, there's a link that you can click if you want the full thing. So once again, if you want the full thing, check the link in the description and I'll see you over there. Thanks for watching, guys.